Hello my fellow humans and welcome back to my channel Scatter Love Tarot back for another daily dice. We're going to get a message on what you can focus on today or what's coming to you and just keep an open mind here. If they do resonate with you guys, hit that thumbs up button down below, subscribe to the channel, set that notification bell so you guys get notified when the next video does go live. Keeping in mind that as you interact with my channel, it allows me an opportunity to connect with your energy and get you out more resonant readings. So let's go ahead and get into your reading and ask the dice, what's your daily dice? So source, what is a daily dice today? What are the messages you want to put out there? What would you like us to know? What are the daily dice, Source? Okay, let me zoom in. I will move those up. Give me just a second. Interesting. There's another daily dice that had these very similar energies coming through. So we have 12th house energy coming through here, guys, with Arian and Uranus energy, okay? 12th house is all about your spirituality, but I am getting this is also connected to addictions. This could be mindsets, an actual act of addiction. Uh, this could be grief. This could be karma, okay? But there's there I do feel like there's something that's coming out subconsciously here. And as it comes out with the Aryan energy here, you're being asked to take it on, to face it direct. Don't just shove it back down and compartmentalize it. Whether that's something that you've overcome, some type of addiction you've gotten through, some kind of uh, grief that you thought you've overcome, whatever it is, and you thought, oh, I'm done with this, I don't have to do this anymore. It, what has been happening is a compartmentalization where you thought you were done there was actually some sort of distraction that came up that uh, that forced you to push it down and not deal with it. And so it's there's something today that's going to come up in your energy and it you're being asked to face it head on with this Aryan energy because as you do, you guys will create a new start in your life. You guys will actually allow yourselves to change in a way, especially with this Uranus energy. This is like radically changing, right? Rebelling against things that once were. It's eccentric. It may look odd to you. It may feel uncomfortable for you, but it's not. This is this is sudden progression, okay, in your life. So as you guys as you guys face this, we're talking about a huge change in your spiritual journey. We're talking about a huge perspective shift for you guys okay and this will help you guys out on the next stint or the next leg of your journey let's go ahead and get an oracle on it and oh sorry that was too far and a tarot card what else would you like us to know about this source okay thank you let me move these up What oracle card will help us understand this a little bit further? Okay, thank you. Yeah, this is building a bright new future. Right? Okay, we have the three of clubs here. It's like you see this, like, this is you using all the tools at your disposal here. You don't need to hide anymore because you have the ability to create what it is you want in your life. You have the ability to do what you want to do. There's no reason to feel guilt or upset or anger about what it is that you've experienced in your life because it's a part of you, right? It's made you who you are, right? There's this song. It's like, um... Better face those demons, just look them in the eye, no reason not to try. Life can be a mess, won't let it pass me by, now let my fingers fly. I use the pain, cause it's a part of me, I'm ready to power through it. Right, like there's this energy of powering through it, like... Gonna find the strength, find the melody, cause you showed me how to do it. So get up, get out, relight that spark, you know the rest by heart. Wake up, wake up, if it's all you do, 
Look out, look in front. What? So, yeah, so anyways, there's a song, guys. <laughs> and that's what they're telling me. It's like, you guys, it's time to wake up and realize that this is a part of you. And this is what makes you you. And this is what makes you strong. It's not who you are. It is an experience that you've been through that makes you you. And you unique to the world around you. And you have all the tools you need to overcome this. To no longer let that be a controlling aspect in your life. Look, we have 16 with 7 and responsibility, meerkat. Like, it's like not seeing everything in black and white. It, there is no black and white. It's this or it's this. Everything is in color. There's always going to be the grayscale. But you're the one that has control over what's painted and what's not painted in your life. You can choose to let things stay as black and white, thinking it's all got to be one way. Or you can allow that to be the guidance system for you. What do you choose, right? It's up to you. What do you choose? But wake up. Wake up. If that's all you do, wake up to you, right? Wake up to your strength. Wake up to your unique journey. Wake up to your desires and your wants. If that's all you do, wake up. Okay, this is what I have for you guys. I hope that it resonates. If it does, hit that thumbs up button down below. And until next time, I'm going to get on out of here. Until then, stay human, guys. Bye.